What do you notice when you look into a painting? Is it color, texture, composition? Zoomer News catches up with Marilyn Lightstone as she talks about the inspiration behind her latest projects. As we drove into the town, I passed this building and I thought, wow! I <laughs> leapt out of the van and ran back to this building. I snapped all these photographs and um, I, um, I was going to show them for uh, another exhibition and call it My Trip to Mongolia and then I realized that would be very unfair to Mongolia because it really showed nothing about the country, or the people, the way of life or anything. This is my third found abstract series. They are abstract pieces. If you didn't know that they were side of the building, you wouldn't particularly know. Because there's art everywhere. Art isn't just what people make, it's, it's, it's what you see and how you see it. And you can see, this is the original photographic image. I printed them out on canvas, but rather than um, sort of have all this in place, this was all painted, this was all blank canvas. It's all one piece, but this was blank canvas. And then I painted black around them. I thought that's a good first step and they all looked very fine just being surrounded by black. But I thought no that's way too easy and uh, also doesn't say very much. One thing led to another, first you know dripping and spattering and whatnot and then kind of you know, painting. Doing abstract stuff is like going on a mystery journey. You basically never know where you're going to wind up. We've been representing Marilyn Lightstone and her works of art here in the gallery for five years now. The response has always been great and exciting and intriguing because we've also had the good fortune of following her as she's developed her style and her technique and it's been such a pleasure to be part of that and to share it with her. I like the fact that she's managed to combine the photography as well as uh, the painting and I think she really tells a story. I think she's really come into her own now. It's wonderful to see somebody with uh, so much uh, character and personality being able to bring such a unique style forward and then keep moving it in such wonderful directions. It's really a pleasure to watch. I always like to see other ways of life and you have to be willing to dare just to leap in and trust yourself and dare. To find out more about Marilyn's latest artistic escapades, you can visit her website at marilynlightstone.com. For Zoomer News, I'm Amanda Lowe.